just conked out again. So now I've got three to try to patch together if I can. Um, now they're talking about this vaccine. That they're going to roll out ASAP. So obviously without proper testing. And they're putting mercury in it. And apparently they put mercury in all the vaccines. We all know how dangerous mercury is. And when the BBC did a programme, I don't know, a couple of months ago, to discredit the anti-vaxxers, they only mentioned the already discredited MMR, MMR um, vaccine tests that uh, that weren't terribly good science. They didn't mention any of the other objections that anti-vaxxers have, such as the mercury. I'm not going to go into it all on here. I mean, you know, there's so much information available. There's no point in me just repeating the same old stuff. Get boring. And then they're talking about making this vaccine mandatory in some countries. A friend of mine, I'm going to consult with my notes again. A um, friend of mine asked me a question. And so what would the government do? Excuse me. <coughs> what would the government do to people who refuse the vaccine? Would we be prevented from travelling on planes, trains or buses? Would we even be denied access to shops? That's stalls for you in it, those of you in America. And this is word for word what I actually said to him. I said, yes, I expect so. <coughs> Excuse me. There's a saying I rather like. We teach people how to treat us by what we allow. The more we quietly go along with all this shit, the more we teach the elite that it's okay to bring in these abusive totalitarian policies. So yes, unless we stand up in huge numbers and rebel right now, before the vaccine is ready, governments around the world will impose the most draconian measures possible on those who refuse to be injected with it. We have to teach our government how to treat us by showing them where our boundaries are. We must refuse to wear the mask. Be free. Go outside. Breathe fresh air and hug your friends. Maybe we could have huge mask-free huggings everywhere. No, I'm up for that. To show that we are free. We must say to government, enough is enough. This stops here. Right here. Right now. Your game is over. <laughs> right, so I'm going to leave it on that note. And uh, see if I can piece these three different videos together. I don't know why it kept cutting out. Oh, I apologise for that. And I'll have to see if I can stop it cutting out again in the future. Namaste.
or as a friend of mine likes to say, no maske. The immune system in me recognises the immune system in you.